Uh, back in Slodine again this morning, sun shining, uh, water still cold. But what I'd like to explain today is when we say you swim close to the shore, stay safe. What I really would like you to understand is that there is a concept called swim failure and cold water incapacitation. In water in particular of 10 degrees and under, which we have, your muscles get really cold. And when they get cold, which is normal, the water is freezing, you lose power. When you lose power, you can't swim. It's like your car on the rev counter going, I have my earplugs, it's like your car going from three to one powering down. When you're swimming and you're a distance out and your body starts to power down, your problem is that you lose position in the water. You start to sink. As you start to sink and your power drops, getting back to shore is very difficult. So when we say stay close to shore, it's not that you're not an experienced swimmer, but it doesn't matter who you are. Swim failure is real. Cold water will take your muscle power. And by staying close to the shore, you're ensured that if you have a situation where you get cold, you're able to get back to the shore. So understanding the impact of cold water on our body is vital. So stay safe out there, get out, enjoy a few minutes, but mostly make sure that you stay close to the shore and respect the water.